today I'm going to be showing you guys this look and it's a coral inspired look my eyes are coral my blush is coral my lips are coral I have coral nails and my shirt is coral I feel like this complements every skin tone and now that spring and summer is here I feel like it's the perfect color it's beautiful so if you guys want to know how to get this look then just keep on watching I'll be starting out with the eyes and I'll be using this Urban Decay Naked Basics palette I'll be using Walk of Shame I'll be using this as a transition color and I'm applying this on my crease area and I'm gonna be blending this in very well Next, I'm using the Naked 2 color from the same palette and I'll be using this e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and I'm applying this in the same area where we applied Walk of Shame. This is just gonna deepen up the crease. Next, I'm gonna be using a blush for my lid. I'm applying this Milani Luminoso blush. This is a great way to do your makeup if you're in a hurry but you want a little bit of color on your eyelid and this is such a beautiful color next I'm using the naked 2 eyeshadow again with the same blending brush and I'm applying that in the crease just to deepen up the crease and make that eyeshadow pop next I'm using the naked 2 again and I'll be using that on the lower lash line this time just as a transition color for that Luminoso blush that we used on our eyelid and applying that over Naked 2 on the lower lash line. Here I'm using the Venus eyeshadow and I'm applying that to the inner corner of my eye and my brow bone now I'm doing my eyebrows and I'm using this Milani eye pencil and this is a great pencil because it doesn't make your eyebrows look like they're drawn in here I'm just setting my eyebrows with this Maybelline brow drama and here I'm just applying some mascara. I'm using the L'Oreal Carbon Black Mascara and I'm applying a generous amount to the top and bottom lashes. Next I'm going to be applying my foundation and I'll be applying this Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. I feel like this foundation is such a great foundation. It's full coverage. It photographs well and it looks so beautiful on the skin I just really love this foundation now I'm gonna apply some concealer and I'm using this Maybelline fit me concealer and I'll be applying this underneath the eyes the bridge of my nose and above my lip and on my chin I'm just highlighting those areas and to set that concealer I'll be using the Rimmel Matte Stay Powder in Transparent and this is just gonna set the concealer next I'm gonna be bronzing up my face and I'm gonna be using this NYC bronzer and I'll just be applying this on the temples on my forehead and on my jawline and bringing it down to my neck next I'm gonna be using the same blush and I'm a, I'm gonna apply this to the apples of my cheeks and this is gonna make the look come together Next, I'm going to be using this Josie Marin highlighter. I love this highlighter. It makes you look 
like you have a glow and that's what we want from for the spring and the summertime so I'm applying that on the top of my cheeks here I'm using this forever 21 lip gloss and on top of that I'm gonna be applying the Revlon Bellini lip gloss it just gives a beautiful combination and this is the finished look it's very simple but it's very beautiful for the springtime and like I said in the beginning it just complements all skin tones now on to my outfit of the day I bought this shirt at forever 21 the necklace I also got at forever 21 and the earrings I also got at Forever 21. If you can't tell, I shop a lot at Forever 21. <laughs> and the jeans I got at H&M. They're light wash jeans and their jeans fit me very well. And this is the completed outfit. Well, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed my outfit of the day and you guys enjoyed the makeup tutorial. And I hope you guys are enjoying my videos. If you are, give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And I will see you next time. Bye.